All right, we're back. We are back okay. on the podcast. I think I'm going to start. The first couple of these I did, they were kind of like, I just like would go up and quickly fumble with it and stuff. But I think I'm going to add some transition music. I've been getting back. Awesome. This trip in, into PEI. Um, it's been a lot of driving and I've been getting back on the podcast train. I haven't been listening mm-hmm. for a while. And like, I don't like too much production because I like to keep it pretty natural, but maybe a bit of well, some drums or something. Yeah. We'll see yeah. what happens. All right. So this is the lightning round. So these are questions that uh, listeners or people I, I've chatted with have kind of given me. And they're just t- kind of 10 fun little questions uh, about you and just different things for you. Okay. Great. So here we go. <laughs> Let's do this. Um, so if you could be any animal, what would it be and why? Oh, my gosh. Um, first thing that came to my mind was a moose. I'm, oh my! I have a moose on my wrist, man. Yeah. I, I love. Mo- they're my favorite. Yeah, they're my best. I was so mad. Have you have you ever been to Algonquin Park? Oh, I'm sure you've seen moose. What am I saying? Yeah, I've yeah, seen. I, moose. I haven't like, been to Algonquin Park yeah. yet, but I was like, yeah. literally, I'm like, who am I talking to? Of course, <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Um, what is your go-to pre-show meal or something you like to eat before shows? Oh gosh, <laughs> anything. Uh, <laughs> the dinner buffets at the Stage West and stuff. Yeah, yeah. L- literally. Yeah, a- anything for me. Really? Co- so you don't find it's you you don't mind, you can eat a big meal and you're gonna be all right. No. I, oh, okay. Well, okay. the thing like what I learned at Stage West was like your eye, my eyes are bigger than my yeah, stomach. Yeah, that's it's dangerous. And then you got to do a show and you're like, oh, I'll never do that again. Yeah, exactly. it happens again. But uh, yeah, a couple weeks later, you're like, oh, what have I done? Yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Cool. Um, what are the okay? This is kind of a fun one. Okay. What are just the first lyrics that come to your head? One, two, three, go. Oh my God. Great balls of fire. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, if you could have any superpower, what would it be and why? Oh, that's a good one. I'd love to, might be kind of like ordinary one, but just to fly. Oh, yeah, for sure. I was chatting with Josh actually earlier about like lucid dreaming and stuff like yeah. that. And I was just like, yeah, if you just like work on it, then you like are aware that you're like in a dream and you can fly. And I'm like, that's Unre- like that sounds incredible. Yeah. It'd be pretty cool. But fly like Superman, not fly like a bird. Cause that'd be tiring. Oh, where you have to work yeah. at it where it just happens. Yeah. 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 100%. Yeah, yeah. That's a good, that's a good clarification. Actually. Right. Yeah. yeah. No one wants to be bird man. Like, like a that. raven. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Um, movie you think you could come the closest to reciting every word from. Oh, uh, step brothers. Nice choice. Very nice yeah. choice. Um, favorite musical theater song sung by someone of the opposite gender. Oh, um, Pretty funny uh, from Dogfight. Cool, beautiful show. I love Pascal Paul. Uh, that show specifically is gorgeous. That show is. I love that show for yeah. sure. For sure. Uh, favorite childhood story or like a nursery rhyme? Oh, um, it's an indigenous story from White Horse. Uh, How the Raven Stole the Sun. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Very yeah. cool. Oh, it's sweet. It's so funny. Some of these questions, like it's, I bet there's like a selfish vibe around me. I just hear about things that I'm like, oh yeah. Or like books that I want to read. Yeah, Those totally. kind of things. I'm like, oh yeah, just, I got my own list going. Stuff. Yeah. Um, so you're an incredible piano player, obviously, but if you could be a, a virtuoso performer at any instrument in the world, what would it be and why? What would it be and why? the why like the harps coming to my mind for some reason yeah just i've had people say the harp before that's <laughs> just interesting that'd be so badass like yeah. that's yeah and you're good you're a one-man tour and you get all you get all the like elegant gigs too like right? you're not playing yeah. at like a country bar with like you're like <laughs> being hired yeah. by the queen and stuff yeah cool so the harp yeah let's do the harp. It. cool yeah. uh if you could have lunch with any person okay. who would it be and why <laughs> oh my god lunch with any person i don't oh that's a hard one um, Ron Swanson, uh, not Ron Swanson, Nick Offerman. Him, there we Nick go. Offerman in character. As yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, and then this is the last one. Kay. If you could put on any show, um, in the world, this is the, your golden ticket, unlimited budget, any show where and why? Oh my gosh. Selfishly guys and dolls, because that's okay. Yeah. Like that's what got me in it. Um, yeah. Guys and dolls I think, or West side story because Beautiful. I, beautiful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is there uh, anywhere specific you'd want them seen? Oh gosh. And or you'd like to bring them? I don't know. No. No, no more no more specific cool. that's just to my head right now. They're just the beautiful ones. Yeah. I love it. That's great. Well, that is the lightning round there. I'll okay, grab great. that and everything. But yeah, nice job. Awesome. And then we should see what the people are. <laughs> that's hysterical. Yeah. With the Mike and Marta and Josh. Is Josh out there too? Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Right All right.